put that into uh, comparison, it means that they are now rarer than the giant panda. Wow. Every horse that is bred helps to preserve and protect this most important breed of heavy horse. Wow. People can become involved and help the Clydesdale Society, which supports its members by becoming a member of the society. You don't have to hone an horse, you just go along and see the wonderful secretary, the one and only Mr. Ian Roy, who can be found in the trade stand section and become a member annually. Everything that you give helps this society to continue into the future. And that's what it's all about. We need to promote and protect this most precious breed of animal. Right, guys, we'll be back to that very shortly, eh? But we're just out to stretch our legs, aren't we? And this is a very slidey floor. This isn't it? Really slidey. Yeah, so we've got to cross and have a little look at one or two of these, these booths, yeah. Superb, that's pretty good. Absolutely. We're just taking a look, guys. Look, it's just over seven and a half grand new. Look at that baby. Hey, look, a poop trailer, eh, Ems? A poop trailer. Yeah, look, it's got a big hydraulic ram right there. You must, you must be able to pull these out to, to drive machines on you. Mm. Oh, I want one of them as well. Got to check them out. Old Series 1 Land Rover. That's an old, old, old. Yeah. Look, the wee dash. That is old. Yeah, I a little shot. Look how beautiful it is. Obviously, this has been well maintained and looked after, this one, isn't it? This is old. This is gorgeous, isn't it? It's so beautiful. It's crazy. I love it. It's a big fancy. So, yeah. And look in the back. Goodness me. Fire extinguisher. That's right, you'll find these all over the world. Hey. Those are confusing. No, that one's been fully restored. Like the paint mark and everything. It's no, been it's fully dusty. restored. It's dusty. Oh, it's just beautiful, isn't it? It's dusty. Take a look at this. It's a Polaris, look. Yeah. Oh, that is just 22 grand. It doesn't stink either. No, it doesn't stink at all. It's brand new, that one. Yeah, absolutely. There's hats over there. Yeah, jewel overhead oh, cam. Hey, yeah, go look, big farmer's quad. The big farmer's quad, look. What are you, eight and a half grand for that? Yeah. Oh my <laughs> goodness. Brian and his wife Colleen, owners of the ranch outside of Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Oh wow. Brian is currently the driver of the world champion for Tron Six Horse Gage. Wow. Wow. Oh wow. Ah, you know that, don't you? Oh, wow. Look, Emily. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 
Unbelievable. Here we go. He's going to change three names. Wow. Look at the memory. These are traditionally the pairs the wheelers of a team. He wants them to make as a team. Look, they want to see one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Never break the stride. Always on the bike. Always listening to the driver. So Johnny Goodwin stands tall. And uh, David will be the first to change the round. Okay, where's Steve? He's going to go diagonal, is he? They are just beautiful, aren't they? I'm a look at them. Oh my goodness. It's like doing a last thing. Yeah. Ben, Scott just going past Wow. Oh, he's going to wheel. Go ahead first, doesn't he? He's got kind of stopped. Wow. I thought they were supposed to be walking, but maybe not. I hear them wrong. Wow. It's the same Emily, this is unbelievable. Absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at them. And now, guys, you see, look at the size of them. These are big, big horses. And these are full grown ones, I think they're like five or six years old. Yeah. Oh, little man. <laughs> hey, what do you say to that, guys? What do you say to that? Even the carriages are beautiful, look at them. Yeah, definitely. We'll get one with alloy wheels on the 22 inch alloy wheels. Lowered. Yeah, lowered suspension. JJ Bang Bang wheels, baby. Now, that's the, that's the judges going around them now, I think, look. Yeah, that, that's the judgy guys there, isn't it? Some of them, anyway. Careful, darling, watch yourself. Yeah, we all got told to get away from the fence, didn't we, Emily? We got in trouble. Well, I could sit and watch these guys all day long, let me tell you. They are just gorgeous, unbelievably gorgeous. Mm, so beautiful, aren't they? 
And the heat is showing in. Is there more coming? But there's more coming from around the spot part here. Can we see you guys? Inspection is nearly done. more coming out. Uh, the, uh, remaining five will join us. Wow. And Isla Butte, yeah. Oh, we've got more coming. Here we go, wow. Oh, is a young guy driving, look. And then young, with the key stands. And then Kelly Burn. Last but by no means least. Yeah, it's good going, isn't it? Right, so we've got to come across now. Wow. 
Well, guys, I think me and Emily are in love with these horses. Then you've got the two wheels, which has been a little yeah. bit longer, maybe eight, nine years. Sort of babies. And both of those classes yeah. are giving another format, another use, and another way to use the Clyde stones. And that has to be good, because this is a magnificent sight, ladies and gentlemen. That's unbelievable. Look at the harness. Each single harness is eight hours of cleaning. Wow. Proper boot polish, proper sweat and blood to get that harness and the brasses and the leathers, then the horses, then the vehicles, then the drivers. This is 20 hours work that you're seeing in front of you wow. right here, right now. And before uh, Brian is uh, making his mind up, he's going up and down the line, he's looking at his notebook, but uh, just to show your appreciation. I hope you're all going to be with us later on to that fantastic six horse team. I just take my hands off to the drivers. I have enough trouble controlling one horse on the ground in hand. To think what these guys do is just truly amazing. Our visiting royalty will be helping to make a presentation in this class. We'll be welcoming our Canadian Clydesdale Association Queen, Tori Keatley, along with Clarissa Rasmussen, our Clydesdale Leader Queen from the USA. They are going to help to represent McFadden's contractors and cross sponsors. In first place, ladies and gentlemen, driven by Trevor McEwen, this is Ron and Helen's fabulous pair, Hugo and Kevin. Oh, wow. Second, the name that is synonymous with uh, driving and the name that is synonymous with the Clydesdales. Well driven to uh, Elsa and to Annette and the Pegasus Clydesdales. Wow. In third place. Driving his own team. It is JW and M McIntyre with Fissel and Lizzie. In four, the man who is a surveyor by train but loves his drive styles and loves his show. Very well done indeed to the man from the North East. Well done to Gavin Holmes. Owned by Brian Lindsay and driven by the man we call Snake Hits, this is Stephen Smith with Rascal and Van Dallin Oh, there we go. Yeah, baby. <coughs> uh, what are He's you getting ready for over there? On the show scene. It's taken him quite a long time to get here. Very well driven in sixth. Well done to John McMillan. Oh, you don't want any of them to lose. You know what I mean? They're all cool. These guys. What a truly amazing lineup we've got forward. George Skinner, Keystone Clydesdales, Gleeview Clydesdales, Charlotte Young, and Gulf Country Clydesdales, driven by the one and only Mr. Chuckle Chops, David Walker. A big round of applause once again, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. because the back row are equally as important as the front row. Yeah. 
Det er begge to fiffer da. One year old. Welcome. So these are just a year old. These are just a year old, did they say? <clears throat> no, I think so. You are always hungry, women. I'm hungry too. We'll survive, won't we? So just year old these. Oh, year old these. Oh, just babies. Look at them. <coughs> 